Hello everybody and welcome in to an outside edition of Inside Pitch. People might ask why are they at the stadium today and it could be because our office is relocating and our new studio isn't set up yet but it could also be because the Cardinals are finishing the season here. They will have their final regular season series against the Cubs here at Bush Stadium. Four games up the day we're recording this. The Cardinals did not like what they had in Colorado but they caught a break because the Cubs did not play well either and oh by the way the Brewers after losing Christian Yelich, I think we we're ready to say they're done. Well, they're back tied with the Cubs for second place. Yeah, really an interesting race. Uh, boy, the the Brewers, very, they're just persevering. You lose your second base when you clean up hitter, you lose your MVP. They keep going. The Cubs have lost not only uh, Javier Baez, arguably their MVP all season, but their closer, Craig Kimbrell, he's out with that bad elbow. They're taking in water. They're not scoring runs like they should. And so while the Cardinals lost a couple games in Colorado, they didn't lose any ground. And as this schedule winds down, it's looking better and better for the Cardinals. The Cubs have to get healthy. The, the Brewers have to try to find a way to continue to play good baseball without their, their reigning um, National League MVP. The Cardinals, they just have to hold on. And, and the question mark, I think now, well, there's the one that we've always talked about, the pitching. Mm -hmm. um, but they have, you know, the roster expansion. They've got some young guys who should be able to balance out that bullpen. You've got John Gant, John Brebbia, Giovanni Gallegos, who are all, you know, at a lot of innings. And they've, they're probably some of the most, they are some of the most used relievers in the National League who can provide them some help if, if the wheels get a little rattly. But more importantly, the offense. It went to Colorado, the lineup did, and, and laid an egg in a place that's very conducive to hitting. What did you make of that performance? And, and is this offense going to be able to fire up like it had been in previous weeks? Boy, it's runners in scoring position with two outs. They're not very good. Marcelo Zuna has really been struggling overall, but he has not been good in those RBI situations. Paul DeYoung has not been very good in those RBI situations. Paul Goldschmidt has been very good, but man, Paul Goldschmidt needs some help in clutch situations because that's what's been killing this team. Something to keep an eye on is Paul Goldschmidt in September. His power numbers tend to trickle down in this month and, and he needs to continue to provide some of that power especially if other guys are searching a little bit also got to get Colton Wong and uh, going back at the top of the order along with Dexter Fowler those guys have been big big generators for this offense so you don't want to see them lag now the Cardinals have a much harder schedule Gordo than either the Cubs or the Brewers the rest of the way actually the Rockies are the last losing team the Cardinals will play the rest of the way not the same for the Brewers and the Cubs so the Cardinals are gonna have to finish strong they're going to have to finish here, and if they do that, then we'll be covering postseason games. I think we will be. I've been Mr. Sourpuss, but I'm suddenly liking their chances a lot. I think it's just a nice, you know, not hot, stifling day that's there got you, go. you in a good mood. Uh, for Jeff Gordon, I'm Ben Fredrickson. This has been Inside Pitch. We'll talk to you next time, hopefully from the new studio.